All right, ladies and gentlemen, impromptu video time. We are on our way to see the My Little Pony movie. We, as in Panama Matt. Since when do you It's Panama Matt. <laughs> we got toodles. Aye. And we are right now headed out to see the movie. I got my brony on. Represent. I'm gonna get butter all over this thing. But, uh, yeah, so we are we are headed out right now. What are you guys What are you guys anticipating? Wh what's on your minds? What movie are we going to see? Uh, the uh, Ninja Turtles. Oh, I don't know. Is out yet? No, it's it's got like it's not Ninja Turtles. Multicolored ponies. Oh, Teen like... Titans Go. Oh, good. All right. Uh, we are going to see the Mulp movie. Mulp movie. It's kind of like pulp. But mulp. Mulp fiction? Mulp no, don't fiction. Even, don't even, no, no, no. I'm sorry, no. This is a tasty grass burger. <laughs> what does Celestia look like? <laughs> no, seriously, that actually could be a thing. It could be. It could be. So we're going into this. Uh, it's right now 6 o'clock here on the West Coast when we're filming this part. Um, no, we will not be filming inside the theater. The no no. Wink wink. Wink wink. No winks. Wink wink wink. No winking. We're headed into this right now. The movie is bouncing between a 60 and 70 percent on Rotten Tomatoes, which means as of right now, it's pretty good. It is fresh. Um, so good work, creators. It's funny because it did not take very long for some people to put some rotten reviews up. Like in the first five minutes of it, of the gates opening up on Rotten Tomatoes. Four rotten reviews showed up and four positive reviews, so it was sitting at 50% for a little bit. And uh, luckily it's it's hiked up, so hopefully it continues the trend of going up the hill versus down the hill. Other than that, excited to see what uh, what they have in store here. Um, should be should be a lot of fun. And yeah, uh, we'll we'll kind of give our thoughts. We're not gonna give spoilers, but we'll give our thoughts on the movie. Just excited to see the uh, Batman movie. Should be good. Yep. Lego Batman. Leg it. Legit. All right. We're about to get our tickets. We're about to get our tickets. Got your camera. <laughs> no, I didn't. Well, I wasn't gonna walk in the theater with a camera. <laughs> I, I thought ahead. Pack. So, all right, we got our tickets, we got our shirts, we have our pride for now. Guys, it's, it's Megan McCarthy. What do you mean, no? We have seen real life bronies. Like, I almost didn't believe that they existed, but they are here. And real. We should see it in IMAX. <laughs> 3D. Right. We could have just blended in. You know? What? This is, I wear this every day. <laughs> it's ironic. Uh, right oh. Right. Do you ever see me go to like conventions or anything? Uh, yeah. Not with this haircut. The last time I recorded myself getting a ticket here, it was for Zootopia. And it was like the third time I was seeing it. I ended up seeing that 30 times. Hi there. Uh, we're gonna get three tickets for the My Little Pony movie. All right. So you don't need to see my ID or anything for the movie? No, I think you guys are good. <laughs> right. Just making sure. I think it's rated R. <laughs> Thanks. Hi there, everyone. Are you gonna see your blessed? That's me. Taylor. Hey, nice to meet you. Too. <laughs> so how are you doing? You all set? You look well, all set. you know what? I'm a little bit more dressed than for the occasion here, so... See, I, I just, I wear this shirt every day even to work. So, I figured... No one's gonna think anything. Boy. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Will you enjoy? Well, thank Have you. a fun time in there. We are walking. We're walking in. Getting us thrown out. What's up? What's up? Us thing. <laughs> throw him out. Two people. There's two people. There's also kids. All oh, right. Well, where the heck are we gonna sit? <laughs> See, they didn't even invite Spike to the premiere, so he has to sit in the top row. <laughs> I had to buy his own ticket too. We did it. We saw it. Saw it. We saw it. We saw it, guys. Panama Matt saw it. Yeah. Well, we toodles. Toodles saw it. Yeah. This person behind us, they saw it. Did they? 
And now we're going to go to Sonic's. Alright. And what did you guys think? It was good. I liked it. Enjoyed it. Fun? Yeah. Watch your step. Yeah. Yuck. That's Tabasco sauce. Don't ask how I know. Yeah, so, so we just got out of the movie. There were... Uh, how far would you say the theater was? Almost halfway. Yeah. Almost halfway. Um, which isn't bad for... We know that the main demographic for this movie are people that are probably getting ready to go to school tomorrow. So, And there were a fair few of them there, too. Yes, yeah. There were uh, some, some families and, and parents and a uh, good number of bronies that were, were out there. Um, yes, a few of them did uh, notice. Some of them were like, you look just like that guy. And I'm like, well, he sounds good looking because he was me. Camera change. All right, so um, he sounds good looking. I, <laughs> shut up. No. Okay. Panama Man is mean. Very mean. So um, again, we won't be talking about spoilers, but overall, what did you guys think of the movie? I know we got like the one word. Can I, uh... Yes. Okay. Can I do this? Oh. Is this okay? Yeah. We've seen what this does before. We've seen this. <laughs> Alright. Going on an adventure! Okay. Well I wanna I wanna watch this too. So alright, you so what 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 were your guys' thoughts? Um uh, are we parking? Nope. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, we're about to demolition derby this stuff. Um, no, we're good. Matt, you wanna say your stuff first? Yeah, um, Matt, what did you think? Yeah, sure. Without um, spoiling? Yeah, sure, without spoiling, um, mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I've never given a review while going in reverse. It's, everyone should do it at least once. Uh, all right, well, um... This is nice. I went into it with the same <laughs> expectation of what I went into the first episode of the series with, of, okay, show me what you got, let's see what this is. Right. And I was not disappointed. I was... Well, I shouldn't have been impressed by the quality of the art and all that. Mm -hmm. Very nice. The story... I like that they had people from the original show ahead. working on it, as well as the full <laughs> movie cast. Uh, Might have stopped time. <laughs> you are? Yep. You're, you're clear. Yep, I know. They're both ways. I'm good. <laughs> all right. <laughs> That's right. It, it, oh, it's, hard to, it's hard to review this thing without spoiling it. Did you say something about both ways? Yeah, I've looked both ways. You oh. were clear to go. Yeah. I thought he was discussing one of the ponies. Uh, no spoilers. No spoilers, race. There were ponies in it. I will say that. Spoilers. Um, I, I, uh, we're, yeah. We're allowed to talk about stuff that's been in the trailers and all that, right? Yeah. 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 Trailers, yeah. That's fine. I thought it was really interesting how they integrated the uh, the cat. The birds, the sea ponies, all that into the actual story. Yeah. I, for the pessimist in me, was expecting things to be a bit more shoehorned. Yeah. But I really didn't get that feeling from it. So, um, Sarah, your thoughts, and then I'll I'll hit this up. Um, I think. Um, it was really good. Mm -hmm. That's that's what I think. <laughs> I, I like that there were a lot of nods to things that people who are familiar with the series would understand or references they would catch. Yeah. And then there's also jokes for the adults to enjoy. Uh, so here's a question for you guys. Uh, in your opinion, and it's a little hard because we're all fans of My Little Pony, mm -hmm. do you feel like somebody can go to this movie having no prior knowledge of MLP and enjoy it? I thought they did a good job of introducing the characters and who they were going into it out of the gates. I don't think you need to have any knowledge of the series to actually watch the movie. Agreed. Yeah. And I heard somebody say that there was, I was reading somewhere online where somebody had seen this movie, and they said the same thing. And they were someone who didn't know the show, so they were making an observation of, well, I was able to understand everything. I mean, there were a few instances even in there that I thought this wouldn't. This doesn't seem like something that would happen in the actual show. So, to some degree, not knowing the show going into the movie can help. Yeah. So it was. Now, obviously, you have a good establishment of the characters. Yeah. So and whatnot. So okay. Anything? Anything else? Sarah? Um, I think the art and animation looked really good. Yeah, that was something I was. I was. 
you all saw in, in some of the trailers, I was nervous about the animation, the, the way that the 3D stuff was being uh, integrated into this. I was, I, I didn't, I had faith that it was going to eventually look good, but I was just nervous that that's what the trailers were showing. But there were actually some scenes in this movie that I'm like, this looks really good. Yeah. Like really, really good. So yeah, overall um, animation. I will also say that I like the risks they took with how they dealt with certain characters and certain repercussions of actions. Mm -hmm. Actions had consequences. Yeah. Good and bad. Good or bad. I don't know how you want to say it. <laughs> yeah, like that one scene where the pony got pregnant. I was like, wow. What movie were you watching? <laughs> um, wow. Now, I feel like you and Gabe kind of were chomping on the 3D effects for this movie, but I didn't mind them. Well, I was ch uh, chomping. I was, uh, I was just worried about what I saw in the trailer. And what I saw in the trailer, and I could be wrong, but it worked here. Like, it, I felt like there was more... I felt like it looked like it was more part of the world than it did in the trailer. Like, the, the scene in the trailer has the blimp thing coming yeah. down. Pretty sure it was all the same. Well, you know, you could be wrong. So, that's... Well, I mean, a lot of the trailers had the nope. shadows really nope. rushed, so maybe yep. that was part of it. Yep. Or... Yeah. But... The... Yep, yeah. yep. No, I, it's, I was, uh, there were certain scenes where the, they used the 3D stuff where I thought, this looked really good. So, yeah. Um, so is that it for you? Um. If you have anything else? Um. No, I, I, I mean, I enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun. It was, it was really good. So. Going into this movie, uh, I've been part of this fandom. Actually, of the three of us, I've been part of this fandom for the least amount of time. <laughs> uh, you both were into the show before I was. Yeah. Um, but going into it, I think a lot of the fandom was excited, but a lot of the fandom was rightfully nervous. Yeah. And, and, the, <laughs> and the nerves... The nerves came from. Uh, ah! <laughs> Got some road rage going on right here. It's a five mile per hour zone. How fast can we go? AC road rage. AC road. I do not road rage. Yeah, it's the first do. time I've you seen someone get do. cut off in a parking lot, though. Hey, are you guys compliment? He just ran a stop sign. He did. It's probably because he knows that I'm on his butt. Did he not try to trash your camera? Yes. Good idea. You guys got some rubber on his right rear. I like that we're driving around the mall in circles. Yep. That's that's fun. All right, now where can I cut him off? No, Jeff. First. This is important. AC road rage. <laughs> no. So, um, you're right. I got cut off in a uh, cut off in a parking lot. Cut off in a parking that lot. That person had somewhere very important to be. We made one lap. Yep. He probably had to pee, and I was, I was going. 10 miles per hour with the speed. Anyways. Thank uh, which I need to pee. So, what? I need to pee. It's okay. Now is a good time to let me know. I, so, with the fandom, I was nervous. I wanted this to be something that we could all be excited about and, and be a good representation of the show and maybe be an opportunity for new people to check it out and, and say, oh, okay, so this is what this is all about. Very cool. Yada yada. Um, I was I was very pleased, very happy with with the product. Um, obviously, uh, Megan and Jason um, Jason directed. Megan was one of the writers, uh, and I forget who the other writer was. But but these people, uh, Joe Ballerini, I think it was Ballerina. Mm -hmm. Uh, these are people that clearly we know that Megan and Jason know these characters and and obviously the the staff very well know these characters and that's something that I think very much helped this movie because not, no one's gonna go into this movie or I should say come out of this movie saying but that's not how the characters act they got this character all wrong blah 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 um, I feel like whoa all the ponies are very well represented 
all the characters. Um, I think everyone's going to be able to get some good laughs out of this movie. Uh, and I'm... I now have a sigh of relief moment. I'm more relieved than I am anything else because I'm like, okay, we did it. We, we, we. I, I did it, guys. I made a successful movie. It is a good <laughs> ambassador for the brand. I mean, I'm posting this video, which will probably get 180 views. Should I, should have had Pokemon Go going on this while we're driving around. You snooze, you lose. But yeah, um, I thought, I thought, um, the, the jokes, a lot of the jokes worked. Um, I thought the characters were, I, I thought it was, uh, it was a good story. Yeah. And yeah, I'm, I'm a, I don't want to say too much more in, in the event that I'll start wanting to, to dive into spoilers, specifics. spoilers and specifics. But as, you know, as someone, as a group of us, we've all been in this fandom for years and it, it did, it definitely felt it, like I said, it's a sigh of relief, at least for me, um, that, okay, this wasn't a bad representation of the show that we love, mm -hmm. and therefore it's something that I think a lot of the people in the fandom are going to be able to say, okay, cool, yes, this is the show that I watch, and not be, you know, afraid to be like, ah, great. Um, have fun if you're going to see it in theaters. Have a lot of fun. Uh, remember to, you know, behave. <laughs> um, try not you to... You really need to tell them that. <laughs> Hopefully. I even behaved. Sarah made me. That was amazing. <laughs> I know. But, but the, the reason I'm, I'm saying it is, you know, there, you're going to probably be in a theater with a lot of kids and a lot of parents and adults. And we know that the Brony fandom sometimes get gets that stigma of oh man uh, but this is a good chance for us all to represent ourselves well and show that you know we're just a bunch of people that love watching this show and um, you know a lot of the the weirdness that people see or hear of uh, online or elsewhere it's just we could debunk a lot of it right now so yeah as far as that goes again guys uh, enjoy the movie represent us well have fun and uh, well done to all the staff who yeah. put this movie together. So, so, yay! Yay! Oh, we're gonna 